Hey guys, so today I wanted to put together this very elegant and classy fall night out makeup look from my hair, makeup, and also my outfit. And the first thing I like to do is to fill in my brows as far as makeup goes. I'm using my Brow Bar to Go palette by Whitening Lightning. I cut my teeth on wedding. Then I like to kind of define my brows with concealer. So I'm going in with Hard Candy's Glamouflage Concealer. And I'm applying it beneath my brows and also above my brows to just give you that really defined look. Then going in with Maybelline's Great Lash Mascara and Clear, I'm setting my eyebrows. After that, I like to prime my eyelids and I'm using my Glamouflage Hard Candy Concealer because this stuff does not crease. After that, I'm going in with MAC Soft Brown Eyeshadow and I'm taking a tapered blending brush and I'm just applying this into my crease so that way all the colors blend together very nicely. Then using MAC's Amber Lights Eyeshadow, which is a really pretty goldish color, I'm applying this directly onto my lids and I am not taking it above my crease. Then going in with MAC's Brown Down Eyeshadow, I'm taking a tapered blending brush and I'm packing the shadow on into my outer V and then I'm dragging the remainder of it into my crease. And this is just going to kind of deepen up the look and make it a little bit more dramatic for the nighttime. As far as foundation, I'm using my L'Oreal True Match Foundation in two different shades because I obviously don't have my right shade. But I like to mix these two together to get my perfect shade and I just blend everything in with a stippling brush. Now, I like to apply concealer after that, so I'm using Hard Candy's Glamouflage Concealer directly underneath my eyes, and I'm just blending it in with my Real Techniques Contouring Brush. And then I like to also add eyeshadow towards the very bottom of my eye, so I'm using Max Brown Down Eyeshadow, and then I'm lining my eyes with my L'Oreal Super Slim Liquid Liner, and I'm winging it out. After applying false eyelashes, I'm going in with Jordana's Best Lash Volumizing Mascara and I'm using this to blend in my real lashes with my fake lashes and you can't forget about the bottom ones. And then after that, I'm going in with Rimmel's Stay Matte Press Powder to kind of lock all of my makeup in place. Then I'm contouring with my favorite bronzer in MAC Give Me Sun and I'm just kind of doing the fishy face motion to kind of get my bronzer in the right place. And since this is a night out look, I'm using L'Oreal's True Match Foundation to highlight beneath the bronzer and this is just going to kind of give it a really smooth and defined edge. After that, I like to use my CoverGirl Blush and Highlighter Trio, and I kind of mix two shades together, and I'm just kind of applying it on my cheeks with a domed blending brush by Sedona Lace. I wanted to kind of vamp up this look, so I'm using a Berry Tone Lip Liner by Rimmel, and then I'm applying Max Diva directly over top, and this is just a really pretty matte lipstick. Now the makeup is done, time to move on to the hair and I'm first starting off with Herbal Essences Heat Protection Spray which is basically going to prevent my hair from damaging even more than it already is. Then I'm going in with Numi's 25mm Magic Curling Wand and I'm just curling my hair and this is pretty self explanatory. You guys probably seen me do this a gazillion times already so I'm just going to let you watch me. Now when it comes to the very top portion of my head, instead of curling outwards, I'm curling inwards because it just gives you this really pretty kind of like elegant look and I really like it. Then I'm going in with Numi's Organics Argan Oil and I'm rubbing this into my palms and I'm breaking up the curls because they were a little bit too structured. And then I'm just simply going in with Herbal Essences Hairspray to kind of hold my curls in place throughout the night. And then I wanted to kind of do something a little bit different, so I took a piece of my hair and I just bobby pinned it in place. 
and I didn't really feel like my outfit fit the occasion so I just kind of changed it as simple as that and that's about it um, I really just put on a simple black lace dress which I had in my closet but if you do want to dress things up a little bit if you're going out you can put on some heels I'm wearing these ones from BCBG and they are just studded black high heels Here's my black dress. I also threw on some rings from Shop Lately and some accessories to glam things up a bit. And I love being queen. 